find integral 0 to e x raised to 1 by l n x dx. So here we have to find value of this integral that is integral 0 to e x raised to 1 by l n x dx which is a quite easy problem. For proceeding it, at first consider an identity here that is e raised to l n a equal to a that is e raised to l n of any function is equal to that function itself that is value of any function that is e raised to ln of any function is that function itself. Okay. So at first what we are going to do here is we are going to simplify it x raised to 1 by ln x at first before integration. So by using this identity we can rewrite x raised to 1 by ln x as e raised to ln of x raised to 1 by ln x l n x that is e what is a here x raised to 1 by l n x then e raised to l n of a that is x raised to 1 by l n x equals that function itself that is that a itself that is x raised to 1 by l n x okay in the next step we are going to use this identity that is e raised to log x raised to n equal to n log x what is x here that is x itself what is n here 1 by ln x now using this identity we can rewrite it as n log x what is n here 1 by ln x log that is ln x okay this function itself that is this is n n is taken over here okay now in the next step we will cancel this ln x and ln x then what will remain e raised to 1 which is equal to e. So we get our simplified form of this function that is x raised to 1 by l n x equal to e. Now next we are going to integrate that is integral 0 to e x raised to 1 by l n x dx equal to integral 0 to e e that is this function is equal to e. Now what is integral of 0 to e e dx we are taking e outside since it is a constant then what will remain integral 0 to e 1 dx now what is the value of this integral that is x from the limit 0 to e okay in the next step we will apply the limit that is e into e minus 0 which is equal to e into e that is e square. So our final result is e square.